children, it's me Goshka and today's video I'm going to be talking about my new job and how it is haunted. Um, so for all of you guys that maybe don't know, um, I got a new job in a shopping mall and I'm working in sales um, and uh, the place is haunted. And I'm not just talking about the place where I work, uh, the whole mall is haunted. Like, especially like the basement underneath where we keep all our stock. Very haunted. Um, my last video I talked about um, the haunted charity shop that I volunteer in, now I'm going to be talking about my place of work when I work and get paid. Um, I also, before I get into the video, I'd like to apologise. Um, I know this video was supposed to be out on yesterday. I normally post a video on a Tuesday and a Thursday, but um, I, had, I was working the full day and then I had to do a training course after it. So by the time I got home, had my dinner, had a shower, um, I was too tired to um, film. So that's why this video is out today. Um, so I'm just going to get on with the video and talk about um, my haunted job. In the beauty department, all the girls have their like makeup done for uh, Halloween. And uh, it's just brilliant. And they were like telling me like ghost stories of stuff that's like happened downstairs. And uh, cause it was Halloween, um, all of the kind of ghostly experiences kind of come out at this time of year. So I thought, well, this is really interesting. And I thought I'll just share it with you guys. So some of the stories that some of the staff were telling me about this specific store in the basement is that um, apparently sometimes if you're in on your own you get this really eerie feeling and uh, sometimes it, it will be normal and then all of a sudden the temperature will just drop and it will be freezing. One of the guys was telling me that the lights are always playing up and the lights are always flickering. Some people have told me that they've heard footsteps of like someone scraping their feet along one of the corridors. Um, other people said that they've heard lots of noises like banging and groans. Um, the centre is really haunted um, and that's because it used to be a dungeon underneath and apparently the remains, some of the remains of this dungeon still remain and the centre was literally built on top of the dungeon and was is used as um, storage for um, the centre but if you go to the centre and speak to the staff and ask them about some of the hauntings, some of them may not know what you're talking about but some of the staff that have worked here for a while now have experienced a lot of paranormal activity and they will happily tell you um, any of their stories. But that was the story of a uh, my haunted work. It's not as haunted as the charity shop um, that I volunteered in. Um, that basement down in the charity shop seems to be even more haunted than <laughs> the basement at my work. But um, if I have any updates or any stories to tell you guys about the haunted mall that I work in, then. I will tell you and I will update you guys. Um, I hope you have enjoyed this video today. If you did, then please like this video, comment down below, subscribe, click on the notification bell so that you'll be notified when 
my next video comes out also don't forget to share this video and if you follow me on twitter and become a patron of mine i'd be very grateful for that uh, on my twitter i'm doing tarot card readings um, and it's like a special thing that i do for all my patreons that um i i don't do on youtube so if you would like to view my tarot card readings and um would like some exclusive content then please join me on patreon that is everything for me today my spooky children i hope you have enjoyed this video today and goodbye